This past Monday morning, I was sitting in my car right over here, dropping my daughter off at a bus stop. A truck was driving past, reversing, and hit my car, causing a little bit of damage right over there. I right away called 911 because I need to file a police report for insurance purposes. I called 911 at 8.26 a.m. The caller took all my details on the phone and she said the police would be right over. 8.45 a.m., 20 minutes later, I called again. Where's the police? They said they're coming right over. 9.45 a.m., I called the police again. I said I called twice. She said she's going to let the supervisor know police are going to come. At 10.25 a.m., two hours later, I called for the fourth time and they assured me the police are on the way. By that time, I just left. At 1.45 p.m., five and a half hours after my initial call, the police called me and say, where am I? I say, I'm in my office. They said, what are you doing there? I said, it's been five and a half hours. And the police officer explained when I initially took the details, told the details to 911 call, the dispatcher asked me, is this an emergency? And I said, no. Are there people trapped? And I said, no. Does anybody need immediate assistance? And I said, no. So the officer said, I first responded to all the emergency calls. And only after that, to the non-emergency calls. And I was thinking to myself, what a, what a tremendous lesson. In this week's Parsha, we read all about the Jews in exile. By next week, after to being tortured and suffering horribly for 210 years, Moses comes to the Jews and says, he gives them the call. He says, we're leaving Egypt. The Torah says, Velo shamu el Moshe, they did not listen to Moses because it was too difficult. The labor, the work was too difficult. They didn't believe. They didn't understand. They couldn't dream that they would be leaving Egypt soon. We are currently also in a 2000, nearly 2,000 year exile. And that emergency call has come. The Rebbe promised us we are the last generation of the exile and the first generation of the redemption. That call to leave exile is here. We are going to leave. Let's believe. Let's do a mitzvah today to ensure that we will be ready to greet Mashiach right now.